Hello everybody and welcome back to the world's worst let's play of Pokemon Sword Blind Nuzlocke. We are in the finals everybody. The final battle hopefully against Hop. And I'll be honest, I recorded this once already, just the very beginning of it. And uh, my capture was screwy, so I said screw it, we're doing it over. So here we are, doing it over. All I did was the intro. Like that's it. Like just him saying these things right here right now. And it screwed up, so... You didn't miss anything. I just had this sort of flashback, you know? Remember back when we were still in Postwick? When we got our Pokemon from Lee that day? I never would have dreamed that I'd end up standing here facing you of all people. But it's time I finish what was started that day. Got it? The one who will become champion is me. Right. Whatever you say, buddy. Whatever you say. And the music is just all kinds of amped up. It's pretty cool. Double, cause I thought so. I knew it. Stone, gonna wreck you. Gonna wreck you into next week. We battled back in the garden, but I'm really, really fired up for this match in the stadium. Alright, you and your fluffy soccer ball are going down. Earthquake! Uh oh, Cotton Guard. Whatever will I do? Strike from below. Alright. I see what game you're playing. I won't do a whole lot to me. Yeah. Not much at all. Gonna punch ya. Gonna punch ya again, I guess. Well, this is really anticlimactic, Hop. I'm not gonna lie. Neither of us are really doing like anything to each other. You just had to up your defense, huh? You crapper! Darn it, Hop! This is just stalling me out, and I hate you for it. Ugh! I hate you, Hop, because there's nothing better I can do. Literally nothing. I just have to go for it. Actually, no, I can use it as a special. Screw you, Hop, man. Making me use. Making me switch out for this crap. I hate you, Hop. You're a piece of crap. You're just a bunch of hot garbage. And I hate you. Yeah, that still does nothing to me. Because you're garbage, Hop. You're garbage. I want to know who else was in the semifinals that gave you the win, because. Gosh, stupid. Now there's the there's the move couldn't use before. Yeah, now you're dead cuz you had no special defense, you piece of turd. Gosh, that was awful. What's your next wall? Cuz darn it, hop. That was stupid. Snorlax, of course. You're just made up of a bunch of normal walls, aren't you? Ugh. I hate you sometimes, Hop. I really do. But your special defense is not that great. Ugh. Not very effective. Plus, I'm a big bug. I'm a big heavy bug. I ain't no light, lightweight bugaboo. I'm a tough bug, buddy. Take down your stupid Snorlax. Gosh. What next, Hop? What next? Corviknight? Okay, now we're getting into some interesting stuff here. Let's see, I don't think I have anything that really hurt you that bad. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Let's go for it. Put down! Yep, perfect. Gerber, you are just the hero. I knew you'd be aiming for a super effective hit. That was not his voice at all, and I don't even care. He's just made me mad this match. He walled me out in the very first matchup, and I'm mad about it. Not even happy. Pincurchin! Alright, that stupid piece of slub. 
I hate it. I hate it a lot. I'm gonna slap it with some mud because I hate it so much. You try to poison me, are you? You would, wouldn't you, hop? You turd. You piece of hot garbagey turd. Ugh. I'm just gonna slap it with some mud again just because I'm so mad. I don't feel like you deserve to get a good hit on you. I want you to suffer. Slow and steady death. Because I hate that Pokemon, darn it all, and Hop, I'm starting to hate you. You just made me mad this match. That's just all there is to it. You made me mad. And now I don't even care what happens. To you. If you kill my Pokemon, I swear to God, I will wreck you, but... <laughs> Me and Gerber are just taking you down all the way because we can. See? Gerber's got this in the bag. He's not afraid of you. Gerber's not afraid of nothing. Think you got me back to a corner? No way. This will just make my victory all the better. Yeah, yeah, Rillaboom. Bring it on, buddy. Is that your last Pokemon already? Yeah, well. Might as well go for the gusto. Release all the thoughts poured into my wishing star. Time for a Dynamax. Okay. You almost tripped, you fool. That's a big drum. Uh, I'm just gonna use my bug. Okay. Here comes my bug. Here comes my bug. My bug's gonna get you. My boogie boog. Half health Gerber. Bring it. Max strike. Really? Really? You're giant and you're not even going to use the grass type? You're just going to go for a normal? Man, what the heck is wrong with you? You're just dumb, Hop. You're dumb. You're just dumb. This is what you get. This is literally what you deserve, Hop. That was the final battle before the champion, and you've squandered it. You made it the dumbest battle it could have possibly been, and I hate you, okay? Seriously. Just get bopped, man. Yerg. Nuzlocke, thanks, mate. I'm really glad you were the one here with me. Shaw. <laughs> And the victor of the semifinals, the challenger who has won their way through all of the many hopeful trainers in the gym challenge is... Challenger Nuzlocke! You know, even when Sonya was saying that you and me looked like we could become heroes, I really never felt like one. But you, mate, I think maybe you could really do all sorts of great things. Good on you, Nuzlocke, and Gallark and all the rest of your team. You mean stones? Mm. Now what's gonna happen? Heh. Now what? Leon! Nuzlocke! That was incredible! Brilliant! Honestly, there were even tears rolling down my face before I knew it! To think that the two of you set out together from the same town, built up the greatest teams, and arrived here at this point to throw everything you had at one another. These moves filled with undefeatable passion! I was battling. It was battling at its very purest in every possible way. Even though there were some trainers who weren't sure whether you were fit to be endorsed for the gym challenger first. That was you, Lee. Well then, all the more reason. My team members and I will give everything that we've got in us to defeat our challenger. And the challenger standing before us might well end up being you, Nuzlocke. In fact, that's precisely what I'm hoping for. That's right, Nuzlocke. The real challenge is what's coming next, and I'm completely exhausted. I just want to head back to the hotel and rest. Best to refill your energy stores first. Why don't we go get some dinner together? I wouldn't say no, but 
You never care at all what food tastes like, Lee. A night like this deserves more than rubbish takeaway, so at least pick something good. Okay. Ah, I knew we'd end up at the hotel. <laughs> you always come back to the hotel. Challenger Nuzlocke! Hey, no, hey, Nuzlocke! Class, some time for questions? First question. You and Challenger Hop were both endorsed by the champion, making the two of you rivals in a sense, wouldn't you say? How does it feel to have defeated your rival? I'm glad I could beat him. Doesn't quite feel real yet. It was just luck that I won. Glad I could beat him. Right, question number two. If you wanted to tell Challenger Hop something right now, what would it be? He's literally right beside me. That he was just the rival I knew he was. I'd tell him how strong he was. I'd thank him for the great match. Man, none of these are aggressive. Uh, level with me, kiddo. Your honest thoughts here. Think you can win the finals, too? I absolutely do. All right, that's enough. Nuzlocke's already tired from battle, and you've been asking rather rude questions. We've got ourselves dinner plans with my brother, so sorry, but clear off already, would you? Yes, yes, I understand. Looking forward to seeing the birth of a new star. Phew. Famous people sure have it rough, eh? I hope Lee gets here soon. I could eat my own arm about now. Several hours later. This is absurd. Even Lee's never this late. Something's not right. Really? They waited several hours? Really? He always does what he says he'll do. As a kid, he promised me he'd become champion one day, and he went and did just that. He ought to be able to keep to his own dinner plans. Kids sure got a mouth on him, eh? If you were that noisy during battle, you'd unleash a whole new level of power, you know. Oh, pack it in, Piers. I'm seriously worried here. So I don't need to see your smug mug looking like you got a go at me, even though you act like you're giving me good advice. Judging by appearances, no wonder you lost to your mate. If you're looking for the champion, I saw him heading to Rose Tower. Why would he go there? Dunno what he's up to, but I ran into him at the monorail platform. He said to tell you that he had something to do with Rose Tower, so he'd be late to your dinner. But why Rose Tower? What could he have to do there at this hour? Pierce, do us a favor. Take us to Rose Tower, would you? Neither Nuzlocke nor I know the way. Sheesh, what rude siblings. I was so demanding of others. Though, I suppose. It's a real problem for me, too. The finals are held up for any reason. And I don't really hate the two of you little runts. You were good enough to beat me, after all. So I think I'll invite Team Yell along. And we'll all have ourselves a bit of fun, shall we? Brilliant! You're the best, Pierce. Let's go make a real ruckus. I don't know what's going on. I guess I'll come too! <laughs> Why they made me run out on my own, that's, that's kind of dumb, but okay. Let's save, just to make sure. Man, why am I here for this? I'm totally exhausted from that battle with you, Nuzlocke. We decided that Team Yell would cheer you on, Nuzlocke. Let's help out together. What a beautiful display of sibling love. Uh, however, it is entirely unnecessary. Miss Oleana? Chairman Rose is with the champion in a very, very important meeting. There is no way I will let anyone interfere. After all, only authorized personnel with the proper key can ride the monorail to Rose Tower. That means as long as Chairman Rose is in the tower, no one can disturb him. I, leave, I have hand-selected a member of the League staff and given them a key. Chairman Rose does not enjoy these kind of menial games, after all. Do you think you can tell the difference between normal League staff and the one I chose? Do you think you can find me? What is this garbage? What should we do? Tch, this isn't good, but I got this one. Nuzlocke, Team Yell's yelling with ha will handle this. No! This is brilliant! I'll search around the front of the stadium! What is even happening? For now, we should try to head to the plaza together, right? Yes. Alright, let's all work together in Rose Tower. 
Okay. Let's find Oleana's league mem staff member. That one was wearing those lame shades, right? So... What am I doing exactly? Just finding a dude? This is dumb. <laughs> like, this is dumb. So what happens if I talk to someone who's clearly not the guy? Yeah, I can't get rose charged when someone's doing their jobs. Ah, they just talk like normal, I guess. All right. So I'm literally just looking for a guy. I'm looking for something to look for. Well, of course you are. So what? I don't know what's going on. Am I literally just looking for a dude? This is kind of lame. Nothing over here. I've heard of padding before, but this is ridiculous. Nothing over here. Wasted all my time. Okay. Cool. Glad. Super stoked. Favorite part of the game, right here. Anyone else have a favorite part right here, right here now? This part right here, best part of the game. 10 out of 10, would search again. What even? Why is this a thing? Dumb. Just let me get on with the game. Looks awfully shifty, but I can't get him to turn around. Say something surprises though, I have no choice but to look this way. Ooga booga! Hey Nuzlocke, this looks awfully shifty, but I can't get him to turn... Uh, we already have the key, you know. What? Blast! I turned around! And I can't escape? In that case, time for a Pokemon battle! Yep. Macrocosmos Eric. What? You have a Meowth? Just straight at Meowth. Really? Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to wreck the crap out of you. Skadoosh. So sorry. Durant. My cheers will really get you going. Thanks for the help. Cool. I really didn't need it. But thanks anyway. Skablow. Oh no, that did almost nothing. And just... Why not have some fun with it, eh? Poof! Gone! Here I am! Punch you in the butt! I am the butt puncher. Don't suddenly talk to me like that, I actually turned around. Yeah, he has many, many voices. All I need to do is hide, and I won't have to give you the key. No, don't. Don't. It's a wonder how fast that guy could run. I've got no idea where he went, Gov. Man, I gotta chase him down at that? I don't even just get to fight him once and call it a day. I gotta freaking... Ugh. This is dumb. Nobody asked for this. Literally nobody. No, yeah, no, you get up there. I feel like you're gonna be helpful in this one. How'd you find me? Or did you just talk to everyone you met? Bah, whatever, I'll defeat you this time. You gonna use different people or uh, same people? Mawile? Alright. Whatever. I'll make a snow hoe. I'm a mega snow. Hmm. Who should I use? Cinnamon. I didn't realize he was just gonna keep using steel types. 
Otherwise, I wouldn't have worried about it. Oh no! He crunched me! Whatever will I do? Feel that flow? Yeah, you feel it in those lock? Yeah! Cool. Skadoosh. Kick you in the face. Both of your faces got kicked at the same time. Da 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 Tink 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 kadonk kading dang dong smack That's what you deserve boy That's what you get I even switched my team Pokemon Pokemon was my Pokemon while I was running. I don't know what I was saying there. They say hide a tree in a forest, so I thought I could hide myself in the crowd. And you just ran away again? What the heck, man? I see you right there! We'll pick this up on the next time. I'll see you guys in. Bye-bye.